Hey everybody, how's it going? This is Eric with One Number Tableau Experts. And in this week's quick video, I want to run through how you change the weekday that a week starts on in Tableau. So I've seen solutions for this where people will go write a calculation and add days to an underlying date, but I don't think that's necessary. So let me show you a, a quick trick here. Uh, so right now it's November 10th, 2022. It's a Thursday. Um, so Sunday of this week, was November 6th. So right now, when I visualized my data showing um, sales by date, it's telling me the week start date, which is November 6th. So let's say that for me, for my organization, my week starts on a Monday. So really that should say November 7th. Um, so yes, again, you could write a calculation, but I think an easier option is actually just changing the date properties of your data source. So this is something a lot of people don't know about. If you go to your data source in the top left corner of your screen and you right click on your data source name, uh, there is an option that shows up about two thirds of the way down that drop down called date properties. So if I select date properties, uh, one of the properties that I can change is the week start. Uh, so if I swap this to Monday, this is going to go from November 6th to November 7th. And actually all the data will shift a little bit because every day will be getting pushed into, you know, a different week. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's switch this to Monday. And I want you to watch this label when I hit OK. Okay, so you'll notice that that label now says November 7th, which is Monday of this week. That's now the week start. And another reason that this change is, is really nice and why it's important is that additionally, if you ever reference um, a difference of weeks in a calculated field, it will recognize the change that you just applied. So what I mean by that is I, in this second worksheet here, I'm just showing sales by day for this week. So I wrote a calculation, which I'm using as a filter, which says date diff week order date today equals zero. So basically I'm saying, if it's this week, show me um, the sales. So previously this was showing November 6th through November 10th. Now it's showing November 7th through November 10th. So one more time, you right click on your data source, you see the date properties drop down and you can change your week start. And you'll notice there's actually a couple other things there like fiscal year start. So I hope that's really helpful to you. Um, hope it saves you some time and some heartache and some energy writing formulas. So thank you for following this video and we look forward to bringing you another one next week. So we will see you then. Thanks.